Hello, 282. So if you spin this lacy, no way there, it's equal. It'll hold a bit better. There you go. You can use this as a job application, Lacey. So Zian's going to Brisbane, Bris Vegas, baby. Lacey's a Jero girl. She's trying to find a place as awesome as Geraldton, but not Geraldton, so she can practice elsewhere before she goes back to Geraldton. A little bit lower, brother. Yep. Oh, yep. Cool, cool, man. Down around the fetlock. A bit broader. There you go, brother. Sweet. Yep. Right there. Final year Murdoch students, roommates, mates, good buddies. Ooh, long foot. So I got some water there in a bucket for you if you want to give it a clean up to have a good look. Ye old silver bucket. Yeah, I love it. Yeah, so overgrown, same classic story. Down here in Esperance on this sand plane, it's like living on shag carpet. Their feet don't wear. Sorry. So the side wall, instead of being edged there, it's rolling up under, and it puts uh, rotational forces on the pedal bone that makes them grow out these funny slippers. You got that big old slipper there. Cool beans. She's got the old manure spreader happening there. Lovely. So Lacey's um, got a little loop there to keep it away from the body while Zien does the job here. So Zien, how, how do you know how deep to go? Yep. Hands, hands breadth from the yep. So you can, and so I don't I don't take a big chunk. Normally I take a bite and then just kind of work back, and you'll see the um the you know the uh, the interface between the the hoof and the pedal bone, the lamina. Yep. Sweet. It's pretty long slipper there. Hey. Snip nip nip. Come in from that angle, I reckon, to get a big get a big bite of that son of a gun. You can see the straight axis down the middle of the hoof wall where you're gonna want to nip all that off. Like you can almost come in from behind. But if you follow me and yeah. see what I'm talking about, there you go. If you choke your bite up a little bit, it'll make it next time it'll make it a little bit easier to bite. There you go. Okay. See, so you can come in. Okay, I'll show you. Yep. You come in right there. You can take all that extra oh, okay. stuff. See, uh, see where the, the axis yep. of the central hoof wall is? Gotcha. Yep. Just don't get too far. Don't come too, too far into midline or you'll, you'll cut into the lamina. There you go. That looks good. Snippity doo dah, snippity eh. And you can kind of keep working back, looking better. Before we get into El Grande. I see you got any uh, embarrassing roommate stories about. Uh, is he in here? Is he good at is he good at uh, doing the dishes and stuff and, yes. and doing his share of the of the job? Does he? He's the man. He seems like a goer. I lived with a whole bunch of different housemates in uni, and it's funny. There's always like one person who mostly does the dishes. Sometimes it was me. Sometimes it was somebody else. But there's always someone who's just like I can't handle everyone else's threshold of dirty dishes in this. And so then they're like the first one to jump in. That's the end. Yeah, let's get into that sidewall and then you can come back and get some more of that tip. Yep. So remember, try to get that. Yeah, that's the way. Work with just one side of the disc. Hello, love. You're okay.
Okay, again, remember to keep that one edge going so it don't kick like that. Yep. And uh, okay, just keep going until we kind of see that little bit of a little bit of a crack there that we're working our way through. Just keep working on that a little bit more there and then try to come in and knock down. There's a lot of overgrowth on this toe that we want to try to remove. And then we're probably going to come back to about there so we could. I can do some nippity doo dah for you while you, you do the grinding. Turn around this way. See, I use my leg for one side to give myself a bit more power. Makes it a little bit easier to knit. Yeah. I'm just keeping an eye on the uh, the edge of that, looking for where I'm starting to see the lamina. I start to see the lamina, I know I'm getting close to the tip. Got a little nip, nip of stuff there. Again, a hand breadth. So got a little bit of room to go there. You can see there's a heck of a lot of extra soil out over that tip that you can grind back for me. I'll get into this other side too while we're there. All right, brother. But yeah, if you can kind of, you're getting pretty good there, but try to get in there and cove that out a little bit. And yeah, some one It's really side. solid, so no flex in it yet. And just keep, yeah. Solid, so it's probably a bit more on the medial side. Or yeah, yeah, see, see, what, see what's going on. Yeah, more of that medial aspect, yep. Magic, looking good. Cool beans, and I reckon while we're here, we'll get Lacey to pull that out a bit and just take that bit of that edge off that side. Nice, you can trim the next one. Do you got any embarrassing Lacey stories while she's working there, buddy? Uh, she sings really well. In the shower? Okay, you alright? Alright, love. She wants out of the crack. Here's team Quinn Levin. How are we going, team? Nice. Yeah, reestablish on that sidewall. That's good. Yeah. Cool beans. I might do some final touch-ups. Kind of, kind of <laughs> Dodge, are you? Hey, I'll take the dodge, yeah. I'll leave you the rev, is that alright? Yeah, heck yeah, I love revs. They're rad. You can always watch that back leg. They can get you pretty easily. They don't mean to. They're not very mean. Thank you. Thank you. 
Okay, so the next one's on this side. Yo!